makeup, makeup, makeup. The ubiquitous plague on womankind. If you are beautiful like this woman, makeup doesn't change that fact. It only hides some of your natural beauty. And it also lies to people about how you really look. So makeup is lying. And if you're ugly, well, that doesn't change that. Makeup doesn't really change the fact that you're ugly. Or it has an expiration date. Let's say you marry a man who sees you one way, but then the makeup washes away, and then he wakes up and looks at this. He's like, wait a minute. False advertising. Makeup is false advertising. Makeup is for clowns and geishas. The red lipstick nonsense is obviously symbolic blood sucking because women who are fake tend to be gold digging blood suckers. I married a feminazi atheist bitch. It was the biggest mistake of my life and she loves makeup. I told her never wear makeup. She promised not to. She lied. Long story, but the point is, makeup is a red flag that tells you the woman is a bitch. And if this offends you, the hell with you. Truth hurts. Truth needs to be said anyway. Go to hell. Now here you have a fake woman who is young and a fake woman who is old. As you can see, her real skin can be seen above on her forehead. So who is she trying to fool? Who is going to be fooled by this? If you're going to be fake, be fake all the way. The old lady wears lipstick even though she's old and because she's old, she's not beautiful so much at all. So wearing makeup is a, is a desperate attempt to look beautiful when you can no longer look beautiful. It's actually disgusting. In the mongoloid world, yes, mongoloid, I said the word mongoloid, that's not racism, libtard, shut up. In the mongoloid world, you have this obsession with looking more western or with bigger eyes and a lot of women, they dye their hair blonde or whatever, which is stupid because it's ugly. They think it's beautiful, but it's actually disgusting because they're lying about how they look. Lying is disgusting. I like mongoloid eyes. They would call it a fetish, but it's not a fetish. I just like it. If I like the taste of vanilla, is that a fetish? No, I just like it. I like chocolate uh, also. Anyway, <laughs> uh, they, they, they waste so much money to look like someone they're not. It's still a lie. And uh, I mean, if a guy doesn't marry her because she looks like she does on the left and he marries her because she looks like she does on the right, then he's, a, then he's not worth marrying because he doesn't really care about you. He cares only about how you look. So if, so if you ever become old, he will not be loyal to you. That's what you want to attract. The fake. Now, makeup is like this fake butt uh, padding. You can lie only so long, but you cannot keep lying. And it's just disgusting because you're lying. Liars are disgusting. But makeup is a huge industry. And the greedy, the greedy want you to believe that you need makeup. Or you're not professional. That you need makeup or you will not be loved. Maybe you won't be loved by fake guys who are superficial. But there are a few non-superficial people out there. Guys for woman, woman for man. That's the way it should be. Anyway, Satan, represented by this Antichrist representation here, wants you to believe you need makeup. Now, are you going to be fake and a liar and pathetic and waste your money? Or are you going to be yourself? Better to be a true ugly person with a good spirit that doesn't lie than a fake person, a liar. Makeup is a lie, it's disgusting. Woman, not all men like makeup. 